안녕하세요. 예, 누나. 어. 안녕하십니까. 이모. 이모. 음, 이모. 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 Hey guys, Matt Jones, and uh, it's uh, the 17th of February. I'm in Seoul at uh, one of my favorite restaurants with my favorite 이모. 예, 사랑해요. 사랑해요. 네. 사랑해. 예. And um, that makes it day 48 of what I'm calling 100 Days to Harvest, which is a uh, an initiative to get me up to the project friendship tree. It's a project I'm undertaking to tell the story of friendship between Australia and Korea. And like stories are largely what define who we are. And uh, this recording today is actually addressed at schools, um, schools that have some affiliation with uh, Korea or Korean language, or schools that want to explore uh, the aspect of, of uh, Asia and Korea uh, in a little bit more depth. And um, my mind, of course, goes out to a good friend, uh, Fiona Pira, out at uh, St Andrews Public School. So, Fiona, uh, I'll be sending this to you first, and uh, look, look forward to your advice about how to best to prosecute this um, this discussion. Because uh, I need some I need some help navigating it through. Let me explain. So, uh, yeah, I guess yeah. yeah. So, Emma was just saying. Uh, what email means, of course, and uh, it means auntie. And so, a lot of schools, uh, part of the way they address screen studies is through language. Uh, language helps you to get out and um, enjoy, uh, enjoy, enjoy food. Like I've got my uh, kimbap here for lunch. So it's a it's an entry point into culture, and understanding culture is an is an entry point into a broader education. Uh, I think it's critical for our youth today to have a, a much broader appreciation of the world we live in, which is uncertain and, and fast changing. So the project French Retreat basically is going to um, uh, be an exchange of uh, experience uh, through a medium using augmented reality on a postcard that will tell the story of the seeds of friendship between Australia and Korea. Uh, I'll send a, another video attached to this that will give some broader information about that. So basically what it will look like is, is, a, is a postcard. On one side will be a picture which through a handheld device uh, that will be able to be um, uh, accessed, a digital, digital image with, with uh, photographs and a narrative that will, that will tell people the, some, some of the early stories of friendship between Australia and Korea. And there'll be some other information on there too, such as some of the more contemporary stories that people have. What I'm interested to know is what's your experience as a school um, and how best could you engage with a project looking at the story of friendship between Australia and Korea. Uh, importantly, the, the postcard also is aimed at uh, school students in a, on the reverse side where people would write. That would be uh, for students to write to a twin school in Korea or Australia, respectively, and then uh, that will become, uh, I guess, in itself, an, its own seed of friendship. So, basically, putting out there for for you to be part of the journey, for you to be part of this experience, uh, I'd like it to be something that brings value to the school, that um, that helps uh, you in in uh, in what you're trying to bring to the students. Uh, an experience of getting to know uh, culture, Asia, language a little bit better. Uh, really welcome your advice to help um, tighten up the project Friendship Tree before we deliver on it, but also an invitation for you to be part of that. So I'd like uh, to know uh, whether you'd like to be involved, uh, what you think that might look like, uh, whether you've already got an existing relationship with a school in either Australia or Korea. And, uh, and how, how it might be best to communicate to the school. Uh, that's one thing I'm a little unfamiliar with. Um, and I, of course, respect the fact that schools uh, have their own governance and then they sit within a broader stru uh, a structure of within the state governments too. So I'm, I'm, uh, I'm aware that, that uh, there's some protocols there I need to follow as well. And uh, navigating that is something I'd seek your advice on. I'm going to get into my lunch. Um, looking forward to hearing your stories. Uh, Fiona, it's been great to uh, build that friendship with you and, and meet your students and see the great work that you're doing at St Andrews Public School.
and uh, looking forward to hearing stories from other schools too about what they're doing to broaden and strengthen the relationship between Australia and Korea. Speak to you soon and looking forward to hearing from you.